I'm so beep. No. Nate, buddy, do you mind if I just open this for a minute? Ah! Give it up uh, on the backhand side. I know. I, 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 I. What the hell? Everybody, run! Let's start the Q&A. Since we collabed on my channel, will we collab on your channel someday? And will you do another Big Tater video for all the other episodes in Season 1, then Season 2? I would really love to make a sequel to Big Tater of like a Series 2 episode, but knowing that it will get blocked by Viacom again will really be hard for me to make the video. And if I ever do another Q&A, I would really love to have you collaborate. How do you add Spongebob and others in your videos without the background? I use Picolage for my pictures that I use to remove the background. I would often get a PNG of Spongebob and green screen it. If I was not looking for a picture, I would use Picolage's cutout feature to cut out the image. As for videos, I use Runway ML. It's a browser editing software with an AI masking feature. It works really well and can easily remove the background. Did I forget to mention how I also use Picolage to make my thumbnails? What's your opinion on My Little Pony? I mean, it's okay, but I've never watched the show before, so I'm not interested in it. Here, have a cookie. Ah, uh, <coughs> and that's the third Q&A. I'm sorry if this video is too short. Not many questions were asked, but I still got on with it. But before we wrap up the video, I'd like to give a bit of a shout out to my good friend Bob the Unicorn and the new Flag the Source music video that I and him collaborated on. Please subscribe to our channel and Flag the Source is in the link in the description. Goodbye, everyone. Did I sound that young back then?